Hi, I'm Harper. Um, I wanted to talk to you really, really quickly, really briefly, which is a challenge for me, so bear with me, about the bags on mesh for the Maitreya body. If you have a Maitreya body or you're thinking about getting one, the latest update added baked on mesh. And there's a lot of people who are very confused about what that means. The uh, Maitreya 4 body was a little bit different from the Maitreya 5. Maitreya 4, you had to add your body, your left hand, your right hand, and your feet all separately. Maitreya 5, your hands and feet are included, but your layers are separate, and this is because they've added Baked on Mesh. Baked on Mesh, in a nutshell, it takes system level information and applies it to your mesh body. Instead of having to use an applier, which is a workaround to get um, past the system level information, Baked on Mesh uses that system level information. When you first join Second Life, you have a system avatar, and that system avatar uh, persists. There are pieces of your avi that are still a part of you, even after you have switched over to uh, a mesh body. So these are the pieces of my uh, system avatar that are still on me, and I cannot take them off. They will be there forever. This is the system level information that normally you use an applier to overwrite and you kind of cover it up like a layer of paint. Baked on mesh does something completely different. It uses the system level information in order to create for you your, your bod, yourself. It says, okay, instead of using um, uh, uh, a layer of paint on top of and an alpha layer to hide the system information we're going to use the system information so uh, if you have a skin that you want to use make sure that if you have your baked on mesh body on you're using a skin like this with this weird squiggly pink symbol on it that and all you have to do is add it to yourself if I take this off it will revert to my system skin. And you can watch it do it. That's the sound of the system going, oh, let's switch back. And now I, that is the system skin from Bitsy. That's this showing through now. But let's say I want my, I want my skin back. All I have to do is navigate to the folder that it lives within. I'm very organized. I'm sure you can tell. Pick the one that I want to wear. Add. Watch this. The system simply overwrites it and says, okay, that's what you're wearing. Voila. You will notice I do not have on uh, an alpha layer. I have multiple stacked windows. There's no alpha. Matria 4, you had to wear an alpha in order to cover up all this system stuff. If you're using Baked on Mesh, you don't have to use an alpha anymore. How to know if you're using Baked on Mesh? Look in your Matria HUD. It's up here. I have mine right there. This Bakes on Mesh. You see that it is white letters? That means I'm using it. If I turn that off, It goes back to, if I, if I don't want to use Baked on Mesh, you have to use an alpha, okay? So if you have a skin that is not Baked on Mesh ready, you must use an alpha. But you can apply it to your Matria body just the same as always. Or you can use a Baked on Mesh skin. The joy and wonder of, of course, the Baked on Mesh skin is... Once I'm in here, I can use tattoos. I can layer multiple tattoos. I can add lots and lots and lots of tats if I want to. I can stack up to 60 some odd tattoos on myself. Just one after another. Uh, the order that you put things on kind of matters. So I put my skin on on top of that tattoo and it made the tattoo disappear because the skin overrode it. So put your skin on first, and then any tattoos that you want to wear, like so. 
Uh, also, if you have any system type uh, underwear that you like a whole bunch that you want to wear. This is my favorites folder. It just makes it easier for me to find things. So I could come over here and this, you see this little, looks like a wife beater camisole image, this thing, that, if I wear it, it's a system piece. So it will automatically, the system will apply it to what should be the underwear layer. And as you can see, now it's showing underneath my clothes on top of my tattoo. You can stack as many pieces as you want for a lovely layered look, as long as they are system. If you want to use an applier, so I have some applier under things that don't have these system level files added into them, that's fine. All you have to do is add your clothing layer, tattoo layer, or underwear layer to your material body, and then apply it to the appropriate layer. You can then use your HUD under the layers up here to control. You can see I don't have any layers added to me because I'm not, I don't have to. This is just me, it's what I am right here, boom. Okay, that is the world's fastest, or at least as fast as I can do it, Whew. overview of Baked on Mesh. If you have any questions or problems or you need help, we have a Discord channel. Pop over, join us, um, ask your questions, and I will attempt to answer them. Thank you, guys. This is Harper. Uh, I'm over at the Enchantrix Empire Sim. You can find me. I'm also on Twitter, Enchantrix Harper. Uh, good lordy, I'm everywhere. Just Google me. Find me. Also, I'll put the links in the uh, video description. No worries. Happy Second Life.